Hello everyone, so today we are going to paint some tulips and I'm using my Daniel Smith watercolor essential set. So the first color that I'm showing you is uh, Pyrrole Scarlet. So we'll be using this color for painting our tulips. And then the next color that I'm going to use is a Cunacridone Rose. It's a pretty rose color. I use this color a lot in my flowers. The next color that I'm going to show you is French Ultramarine. This is also a very much used color by me. And then the next one is a Hansa Yellow Light. And this is New Gamboge. And this is a this is Tello Blue. I may not be using this color. Alright, so I'm starting by uh, with the water and then I'm adding my Pyrrole Scarlet, Knockerdon Rose and some Hansa Yellow Blue, Hansa Yellow Light, the same thing. Another tulip and the same thing, adding some water first and then adding the colors. So I can add another tulip here, again the same process, scarlet, and then the kunakarudan rose, and then the hansa yellow. I can add one more here, and then it's the same process like you see, and then I just add um, some more color, make it more brighter. I, can, I added one more here, and uh, so this one is in the front, so, uh, so I have like five tulips in this. And then we can start adding the stems. And with the stems, I just mixed the French Ultramarine with Hansa Yellow. And then also added some the red color in it. So it's, it's a mixture of blue and yellow and then and also some red in it. Now I'm strengthening the colors a little bit, adding some more scarlet, uh, some pyrrole scarlet and some more conocodon rose. And let it dry a little bit. Adding some splashes, just taking away the color from the front because you, I wanted to make it look like it's in the front, and it, you know, so I just remove some color from there and then strengthen the green color. Now it has dried up a little bit and then I'm just adding some more color to the background flowers so that my uh, the tulip in the front looks uh, looks like it's in the front, right? It's not showing some shadows on the background flowers. adding some more color and adding some more water to spread it just now I'm just adding some lines so just to indicate the patterns like different patterns and adding some water I added the line and then I added the water to just soften those lines Just want to show some patterns here. Okay. 
same process on all the flowers. Adding some more color, just making it a little bit more vibrant. That's it. I think this is some more green, and we are all done. Thank you. Thanks for watching.